Hello, Psych2Goers, welcome back. Do you have a crush on someone? Do you feel like they're barely aware of your existence? No problem. To help you with that, here are seven things to get your crush to notice you. Number one, have a sense of humor. Everybody loves to laugh, and a little sense of humor goes a long way. Researchers from Illinois State University and DePaul University found in their study that when you use humor when getting to know an acquaintance at first, that individual has a better chance of liking you more. They even found that engaging in funny tasks may raise romantic attraction. So if you're looking to attract your crush, try cracking a joke or two, and others may just fall in love with your sense of humor. Number two, show you like them. Have you ever heard of reciprocity of attraction or reciprocal liking? This is a psychological term used to describe when one person starts to feel attraction from someone only after hearing that individual likes them. A 1959 study published in Human Relations told their group subjects that certain individuals in their group would likely like them. After group discussions, subjects told researchers who they liked the most. Can you guess who they liked? Yep, the subjects chose the people they were told initially liked them. So if you admire someone and get them to notice you, key them into the idea that you like them. This may get them to start thinking of you more and therefore get them to like you back. Number three, learn to play a musical instrument. Thinking of learning a musical instrument? A 2014 research study found that those who could compose and play complex music were seen as more attractive by women. According to the lead researcher at the University College, Dublin, the ability to create complex music could be indicative of advanced cognitive abilities. They go on to say that, consequently, women may acquire genetic benefits for offspring by selecting musicians able to create more complex music as sexual partners. Now may be a good time to learn that guitar you've been eyeing. Serenade time. Number four, own a pet. If you've been thinking about adopting a pet, you are on the right track for more than one reason. In 2018, two French social psychologists decided to conduct an experiment. They had a dashing young Frenchman named Antoine approach 240 randomly chosen women to ask for their phone number in hopes of a date. Half of the women were approached by just Antoine. The other half? Antoine approached them with an adorable gray dog named Gwentu by his side. A small 10% of women gave Antoine their number when he was alone but Antoine's odds went up to 30% when Gwendu was his wingman. This is likely due to the idea that owning a pet shows that you can handle responsibility, are caring, committed, and the dog's just really cute. Need further proof a pet will make you more approachable? In a research study led by University of Nevada, Las Vegas, anthropologist Peter Gray found that 36% of men and 35% of women were more attracted to someone who owned a pet. If you adopt a rescue animal, your odds only grow. 49% of men and 64% of women were more attracted to someone who adopted a pet. Also, if you don't like pets, the data doesn't look good for you. 54% of men and 75% of women said they wouldn't consider dating someone who didn't like pets at all. If you wanna get your crush's attention, you'll seem more approachable if you have a furry friend by your side. Number five, show confidence and use open body language. Have you ever heard confidence is key? Well, showing some confidence can be key to getting your crush's interest. Displaying a bit of confidence is often seen as attractive. Why? Well, generally people wanna be confident. So seeing someone who is confident is admirable. One way you can appear more confident is to display open body language. Keep your chest and torso more open and try not to cross your arms as much. Closed body language can give off the impression you aren't available or simply don't wanna talk. And remember, availability is key in giving your crush a chance to talk to you. Number six, choose deeper conversation over small talk. Research from Harvard found that deep conversations and meaningfully talking about yourself can help activate the very same regions of your brain as delicious food or sex activates. The study states that over a 45 minute period, Subject pairs carried out self-disclosure and relationship building tasks that gradually escalated in intensity. Study one found greater post-interaction closeness with these tasks versus comparable small talk tasks. So instead of bringing up the rain or the clouds, maybe choose to delve into those interesting discussions with your crush instead. 
And number seven, be a leader. Imagine this, you've just been assigned to a group for your next group project, and your crush happens to be in the same team as you. This is your chance to get their attention. If you want them to notice you, volunteer to be a leader. In a 2014 study, researchers explored whether feelings towards other people influence the perceptions of others' attractiveness. Having their subjects in groups, they found subordinates rated their group leader as significantly more attractive than leaders outside their group. So even if there is no role of group leader, be a bit more vocal in your project. Guide the next group project, throw out some ideas, teach others. There are many ways you can prove you are a capable and apparently attractive group leader. So will you use any of these things to get your crush to notice you? If so, which ones? Will you be adopting a new pet? Share with us in the comments down below and let us know which of these worked for you. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to click the like button and share it with a friend. Subscribe to Psych2Go and hit the notification bell icon to get more content like this. And as always, thanks so much for watching.